Now in this part of the question, what I've done first of all is because C was a constant, which we worked out in the last part, I've put C into the formula here and updated it. Notice also that I haven't used the rounded version. Now in this part then we've got to find out how many atoms are left when T is 22,920. So let's start off then by saying that when T equals 22,920, remember this is in years so that's that, we've got to find out R so therefore R would equal, it's just a case of just substituting this value of t into the above. So e to the power minus 0 0.0001209 and so on multiplied by t which is 22920. Okay, just work that out on your calculator and you should find you get the exact value 62.5. That's if you used the exact value that you got from earlier for C. Okay, so we've got 62.5 then atoms that are left in the substance.